but I support women in what they want to do. I try to support women as much as I can in anything they want to do or anything they want to be because we all know that everyone with a, a brain goes, well, we should all be treated as equals. I support feminism in that world completely. Where it gets a little out of control is when feminism makes it a competition for no reason. I saw a shirt this girl was wearing. It said, girls can do anything boys can do. And I was like, when? What? <laughs> what world are you living in? That's such a dumb phrase. Girls can do anything boys can do. It's, just, it's also a dumb phrase if a guy has a shirt that says, guys can do anything girls can do. Also not true. <laughs> what are you talking about? Dude, you guys, you make humans inside of your body. That's crazy. Nine months. Probably the most grueling, excruciating, painful, insane, wild thing that humans do. You do it. So leave us alone. <laughs> what do you want? Leave us alone. You want to do these jobs? We can do what you do. You want to do? We don't want to do these fucking jobs. We did them for you. You don't want to do them either. You tricked us. You tricked us into doing them. Now you want them back? What's wrong with you? Thousands of years ago, we lived in caves. And you guys were like, go get the food. And we were like, there's lions outside. And you guys were like, go get the food. <laughs> Fine. We don't want to do these jobs. They're insane. Coal miner, huh? You want to get black lung? What the fuck are you talking about? You want to be a garbage man? That's insane. Picking up shit all day. What is wrong? You want to be an Alaskan crab boat fisherman? Is that what you want to do, girls? You want to lose your teeth and smoke menthols and most likely die at sea? It's awfully convenient that you guys want to do all these gigs after we did them all already. They're done. We built all this shit. It's over. Look. Who the fuck you think did this thing? You think a sorority threw this together? Come on, Alpha Phi. Brick by brick by brick by brick. Leave us alone. You're already mean to us anyway, right? And it's socially fun to be mean to guys because we're big, dumb idiots. I was at a gas station, and this big truck pulled in a lifted truck with huge tires. And the girl at the pump next to me made eye contact with me, and she goes, ugh. I knew exactly what she said in her head. And everybody in here knows, big truck, small dick. Oh, big car, you got a small little penis. You know, on your big truck, you small little penis. You compensating for something? Yeah, for the fact that he never had a big truck before, and now he does. You think men are deep? We're idiots. When we're little boys, we're like, oh, truck, beep, 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 ah! <laughs> and then we get older and we have money and we're like, I buy truck. <laughs> we don't judge our purchases based on our genitalia. That's insane. We don't get out of the shower, look at our dick, and we're not like, oh, Jeep Grand Cherokee, cool. We could never do that to you. You know how mad you'd be if we did that to you, girls? You'd lose your mind. If we equated those things, purchases, to your genitalia, if we, I was like, is that a Louis Vuitton purse? Oh, you got a big clit? What's that? <laughs> is that a gushy Gucci? You got a sloppy gushy Gucci? Yeah. <laughs> Leave us alone. But again, Women deserve to be treated like equals. There's no doubt at all, you know? There is, that's it's not even an argument, you know? You're tough. You're hard to figure out. My dad failed a bunch. He couldn't get through it. Bunch, <laughs> bunch of women came and went. He couldn't figure it out, the poor guy. And now he's older, and he's trying to, you know, get his life back together again. And he's trying to teach me life lessons, you know? I think as they get older, they want to, like, impart something on you, like a piece of wisdom that they've learned. So he's, like, sneaking it in in weird ways. He sent me a box of, like, old stuff, you know, and on top of it was Sonic the Hedgehog. And it was plugged into Sega Genesis. And I was like, oh my God, is this a message? Is he sending me a message? Is he saying, be a kid, slow down, have some fun, you're working too hard. So I did. I got stoned, I plugged it in, and I played Sonic for hours. And it was incredible. It was amazing. And at some point I might have been a little too high. Because I was staring at Sonic and I was like, oh my God. This goes deeper than I ever thought. 
I'm Sonic. Sonic is I. I am Sonic. <laughs> Most men in here are Sonic and you don't even know it. You run through life as fast as you can just to get to the end. That's the goal of the game. Get the coins, give me the money, get to the end. Give me the money, get to the end. Give me the money, get to the end. That's what most guys do. Just give me the money, let me get to the fucking end. That's the goal of the game. It's so twisted, you know? And the whole time, give me the money, get to the end. Give me the money, get to the end. In the game, just like in life, at some point, you bump into these trolls, women, and all of your coins. La, 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 And you're like, give me my coins! No! And you'll never get them back. <laughs> 